This is when it really gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world, and we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. It's PSG, and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. And good evening to you from the Parc des Princes here in the French capital, Paris, the venue for tonight's action. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And now things get really exciting on the UEFA Champions League front. We're at the semi-final stage, and what we have coming up is the first leg. It's Paris Saint-Germain versus Barcelona. Well, this is what the Champions League is all about. Some of the world's best players, two excellent teams and a great stadium. Let's hope we're not disappointed. Disappointing for Barcelona to give it away like that. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Lucas Hernandez plays with Ashraf Hakimi in the fullback positions. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal. Ilkay Gundogan plays with Oriol Romeo in the centre of midfield. And the starting role on attack today is handed to Robert Lewandowski. Koro Mouani. Mbappe. He's beaten his man. Can he give them the advantage? And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. And it has been judged to have been a bookable offence. Well, I think the referee's got that right all round. It was a penalty and it was a yellow card. <laughs> this to make it 1-0. Well, here we can see it again, and he's done well to read the intentions, but just can't get a touch on it as it sails over him. So close to being a fantastic stop. And Barca get the ball moving once more. How will they react? Joao Cancelo. The cross is on. A decisive clearance it was. The free kick decision goes the way of Barcelona. Let's fly here. Well, considering the position of that free kick, that was an outrageous effort. So close. Well, it's a great strike, but just not quite the accuracy he was looking for. Vitor Ferreira. Manuel Ugarte. Well, there to intercept. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. I don't think too many players would have the overdrive to get to that one. Goalkeeper's ball. PSG couldn't keep it. Good run, very much in control of the situation, but nothing comes of it. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Well, that's a completely wasted throw in.
Araujo. Joao Felix. And Lewandowski running with the ball authoritatively. Oh, fine stop. Strong challenge. But the defending isn't over. It's a corner. Over it comes. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? Well, I take my hat off to him because that was superb defending. And there's the feed into the box. Oh, that is an outrageously good stop. Well, great reflexes from the keeper. He did brilliantly there. So the corner played into the box. And it nestles in the back of the net. Barca are level. Well, here's the replay. It's certainly a well-delivered ball into the area. And what a header it is from Lewandowski. He just knows how to get on the end of crosses. It's a very good goal. Well, he knows this is going to be a tough game now. He's got to get his side playing again here. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Kono Muani. Now with Danilo Pereira. Ugarte. Manuel Ugarte. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. Incisive pass. Hernandez. Can he open the door to a potential goal? And it's in! They're back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. So, back underway. Intriguing contest, this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Joao Cancelo given away by Barcelona no foul PSG advantage Toro Muani and teammates around him Sergio Roberto oh that's an interesting pass Well, let's look at this again. And the keeper just lost his bearings there. He was never in the right position. He won't want to see that again. Well, disappointment, anger, frustration, whatever is going through his mind, he needs to get his team going again here. So back underway, dead level, 2-2. Hakimi. And it didn't happen for them in attack. Oh, big chance. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in 
quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, he has to get his team plan again. This isn't going to plan. Well, the action underway once more. And no shortage of entertainment. 3-2. Koro Muani. And now Danilo Pereira. And he's won the ball. Rafinha Lewandowski and now Sergio Roberto well, they couldn't quite muster a real threat now can they hit them on the counter options in the middle have to pay attention defensively splendid tackle and the outcome is a corner here well, just listen to the crowd. They know this is a big chance to equalise. And the corner played over by Dembele. And clearing it away. Danilo Pereira. Here's Mbappe. And a promising looking attack but comes to nothing in the end and there it is the half-time whistle well who wouldn't want to have Kylian Mbappe in their side Stuart a key component of his team yeah he's done okay in that first half he's had a lot of the ball he's used it well and he's been energetic but unfortunately that can't be said about the rest of the team who need to improve if they're going to turn this around So they get the ball rolling in the second half. Barca with the advantage, but no room for complacency. Couldn't keep it. Hakimi Ugarte Hernandez Mbappe Well, it's an attractive passing move but it's all about finding an equaliser here So a corner kick it'll be following the deflection But he's gone short with it PSG doing well to regain possession. Well, chasing this game, but the corner might help them. Playing it short. Just the challenge that was required. That's a good looking ball. Just needs to steady himself. The threat was there, but no problems now. Sergio Roberto. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Koro Muani. And acres of space for PSG out wide. But timely defending when it mattered. So a half an hour remaining. On 
Really good challenge. Nice looking pass. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Oh, big opportunity. Kunde. A fine block. An alert reaction to tip it over. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. And over it comes. And pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. Played over. It hasn't come to very much. Sergi Roberto. And a good-looking ball. And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Well, good run and good ball control. And a shooting chance for Lewandowski. Oh, terrific goal. How about that? Absolutely magnificent. Well, here it is again, and all you can do is admire the skill. That's a really clever goal, you have to say. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Danilo Pereira. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. And the advantage is with PSG. Everyone wants to see officials let the play flow in that manner. But now the free kick has to be awarded. Substitution time it is here. Danger averted. Joao Cancelo. Using his physical strength to shield it. Well, failure to keep the ball by PSG. Christensen. Well, no stopping him. From a long way out. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. They've ceded possession, Barca. Rafinha. Barcelona have given us away. Fabian. Here's Hernandez. Will he play it in? And still pressing. So disappointing for them. This is slithering away. Well, the clock's ticking faster than they would like. I think that had to go in, Derek. Rafinha. Gundogan. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Barcelona have possession again. Mbappe might be a chance here. And there it is. All in the melting pot now. And what a finale we could have in store for us.
Well, let's have another look at this because Mbappe shows such skill to go beyond the defender and Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so cleanly. It's a great goal. Well, how about this? 4-3. Araujo. Christensen. It's with Joao Cancelo. Romeu. Well, three minutes of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Rafinha. Well, they have it again. Well, the injury will mean a stoppage. The referee going down that road, so treatment can be administered now. Started by means of a drop ball. Hernandez. And so the full time whistle. Barcelona will carry a lead into the second leg. Well, at this stage of the tournament, you'd take any lead going into that second leg. I tell you what, though, this tie is far from over. Very little to split between the two sides, and it's set up perfectly for round two. 